guys, it's Eduardo. Thank y'all for tuning into my YouTube channel today. So today we have the Stitches the Clown Look inspired by Six Flags Fright Fest. I only stole the lips from them and the rest is just me. As you guys can see, this makeup is literally melting. It's like 98 degrees right now here in Los Angeles. It's so hot. I'm literally melting. I'm really going to go shower and like wipe all of this makeup off. And to avoid this though, like I tell most of my clients, always prime your face with Cinema Secret Setting Spray and that is really good it has the sealing spray inside of it that's like anti-sweat so it mattifies your face immediately and i always set that on top to mattify my face so that i could avoid this sweating and this sweat drop right over here so that's my personal tip it runs for 25 dollars plus tax and plus shipping if you're ordering it i just go to the store here in burbank they have really good service just make sure what you get is new because sometimes they have used products and i kind of experienced that and it wasn't cute to be honest my mom told me she's like why did you buy it and i want to go return it and crazy drama but anyway so yeah thank you to my 58 subscribers for subscribing to this youtube channel it really means a lot to me i literally did this youtube channel behind my friends back and I, I don't know i think i've already said that before in another video and my parents have seen my youtube channel grow they've seen my art grow and they've seen how i've been spreading all over the los angeles region as a makeup artist and it's just so much fun and it means a lot to me so please help me i need 62 subscribers to make 120 subscribers for my youtube channel it will mean the world to me if you subscribe down there and you like commented down below and you click the like button on this video or on my other videos too like to be honest just be nice yep I think it was probably just there. <laughs> so thank you so much. Comment, like, and subscribe. And let's get this tutorial started. And let's go wipe this off before I sweat my ass off in this freaking kitchen. First things first, we're going to get started by using Snazaroo White Paint onto our face. I would recommend you to prime your face using Cinema Secrets Primer. I didn't do it because it's just um, a one-time thing here. This is Earth Radio. And now here's human music. Once we are done with the white, I'm going to go into my Smashbox Double Exposure Palette and using a BH Cosmetic Blending Brush, I am then just going to dip it into the Black Eyeshadow Palette and I'm going to contour my face, my forehead, my neck, and I, I would also recommend the jawbone and, oh, the ear, the nose too. I would contour my nose, but you know, I'm too lazy. Using my Mirror on Paradise paint in the color royal blue I am then just gonna draw on my sexy jester lips and then using li a light lime green from the Mayron Paradise paint palette I'm gonna draw little polka dots on it give you just a cute touch Using Maron Paradise Paints color black, I am then going to draw a black diamond on my left eye. Using the color lime green from the Maron Paradise Paints, I am then going to draw a splat onto my right eye. Then using Maron Paradise Paint in the color Fuchsia, I'm going to outline it. And then using a uh, lilac color, I would recommend a a uh, red or a white, I'm going to draw the muscles inside of it. This is Earth Radio, and now here's human music. Using Mirror Paradise Paint in the color red and a little angle brush, I'm then going to draw my nose, outline it with black, and then do the little spirals with black. <music> Using a uh, black Mirror Paradise Paradise Paint, I am then going to just juice a little bit of stitches onto my mouth. And then on my forehead, I'm going to get the red blood paradise paint, draw a triangle muscle using the same black. I'm just going to draw stitches around it and make it look like an open wound.
using silver, I'm gonna just underline where I have black and I'm gonna just finish by doing some staples all over my face. I'm gonna cut my neck open. So using blood red, I am then just gonna draw the cut on my face and on my neck and then I'm gonna outline it with black and then the inside using white, I'm gonna just draw little swirls and then dashes down using white as well to give it a scarred look. Then what I'm gonna do is just add some red blend color all over the place and we'll be good to go. Like this, we accomplish this look. Thank y'all for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, guys, and follow my Instagram.